All right, I am Sovereign Sage. Found me again, have you? No. Um. So, messing around with my PS3 version, I was able to find out that I was correct. Behind the dark bishop that I call the Holy White, actually leads to the Fallen City, which is a ruined place that I was talking about. However, I think I'm probably going to abandon trying to find it due to the fact that on my PS3 version, having gone through it, I realized that behind the fallen city is Daimon, who's the, the old arisen. He's, um... So Aura, the girl who brought you here, um, she's actually a pawn, and she was like his lover or some shit. And when she was brought before the dragon, and he was given a choice to kill her or to uh, slay the dragon or what have you, um, it was like too hard of a choice for him. So he winded up choosing to be cursed, and he got transformed into like this dragon-esque monster thing. Um, like he has wings and a tail and horns like a dragon, but he doesn't look like one. Um, so he got transformed into that. And she was freed and became human herself. And she was like turned into an arisen, but not really. She has the presence of one, but she actually isn't one. I think when she became a pawn, she was freed from being a pawn and she was turned human. Um, that's why the pawns say, I sense a feeling much like your own. What they mean is they sense that she's human and not a pawn anymore. So the main gist of Bitter Black Isle is to defeat him. He's like the second main boss of the game of this area. Um, and trying to do it on my PS3 version, I'm at a, a level 127. And it's tough. Because he does this move where he puts a giant orb into the ground and he hovers over it. And it like sucks you down into a vortex into the ground. And he killed all of my pawns like Zelf and Althar and Era. So, I was by myself. He has ten life bars. I was able to take out five of the life bars. We had took out two of the life bars before they had died. Um, so I took out three more on my own. And I ran out of healing items and everything. And it's like a really long boss battle. I had defeated it once. I think I honestly do have videos of it somewhere on my PS3 in the playlist somewhere. I think I did record it. Um, and it took me like two hours straight fighting that boss reason why it took that long is I ran out of healing items, so I kept having to wait for my life to regenerate slowly. And I kept having to, like, attack, dodge, run, hide, attack, run, dodge, hide. And, uh, shit was not fun. And I'm pretty sure people are tired of seeing me fail at Bitter Black Isle. I've defeated some of the bosses, at least, but not I mean, as much as I should. Also, on my PS3 version, I was able to defeat the Cursed Dragon. So the Cursed Dragon appears with the Dark Bishop. Um, however, he's actually a boss. When he appears with the Dark Bishop, what changes is that he only has one life bar. And when you encounter him outside of that, he gets 10 life bars. He's actually considered one of the Bitter Black Isle bosses. Um, it's just when he appears with the Dark Bishop, he, he's, his life bars get reduced to like one little life bar and that's all he gets. So those balls mm. the way they move around that ball makes me get all okay so what we're gonna do is probably try to avoid that I fought all pretty much all of the main bosses on my ps3 version I think I had did that like a day ago so I defeated the the gore cyclops that was inside the the midnight helix I also defeated the cursed dragon and let's see, we fought several, several of the other bosses as well. Currently right now, this is the PS4 version obviously, so we are in the Fortress of Remembrance. In all honesty, like I said, I think I want to leave here and go focus on the main game story, because Bitter Black Isle is like a branch side story for people that have completed everything in the main game. It's kind of more like a New Game Plus area if you want more challenging because this the Bitter Black Isle has the hardest, toughest bosses in the whole game. This is where they are. And this is more of an area for people that have already cleared the main game maybe numerous times. This is like an area if you want to test your metal and want things to be tougher. Then you would come here. 
The fact that I came here from the start, I think I got here and I was like, what, level 20 something? Which is fucking ridiculous. I have gotten tougher though, as you can tell. We used to have trouble with these, and uh, now we don't. Wow, Ira, you went for an overhand swing and got knocked the fuck back. She was like, get down on my banshee, pick up that hoe. Yeah, fuck her up. The banshees are still kind of tough for us to fight, though. Like, they're tough. I'm just fucking her up with my ice powers. Isis bite. Is it for me? Yeah, it is. No, it's for L. Is is L? Okay. So, like I said, um, I think I want to move back to the main world because some of the other missions that you do outside of here are kind of more interesting and funner. It's not just me fucking dying repetitively. I just came here because I wanted to see what it was, but I realized on my PS3 version that the Fallen City leads directly to the main boss, and I can't fight him right now. There's no way in fucking hell I'd be able to do that. And originally, I didn't even get to Bitter Black Isle until I was like a level 100, so the fact that I'm here this early is fucking ludicrous. We have gotten tougher though, I was able to find some better weapons, like the daggers I'm holding. Pretty good. So, like, it wasn't like a. It's not all bad that I got here. What the fuck is Ira doing? You can see him on the mini map. Just. Hold on. Ira? What are you doing? He's like, you interrupted my, uh. special time. Oh god. Maybe I did. Well, I guess I'll get my ass up this ladder. <laughs> you do whatever you were doing. Huh. <clears throat> Come on. Run at me, you piece of shit. That's it. Run to your death. Oh. Ah! Oh my god! Ah! Oh. Fucking dying! Do I not have any more healing items? This is. Yeah, I forgot. We came into a bad area last time. Fuck me. This is why I said we need to hurry up and get out of here. Fuck it the. Oh! Uh. Wow, what a bastard right now. Did you see that shit? He's like, full on sprint to your face. Oh. Hey, hey. Fuck him up. Explosive ribbit, you bitch. <laughs> if I am to die here, then I will bring you with me, you bitch. Yeah, you need explosiveness to take him out. There we go. Fuck him up. Ooh, right in the pelvic bone with the fucking explosive. He'll never know what hit him. Wait a second. Don't we have... Fucking give me this. That's it. That's it. Fuck him up. I didn't want to use it here, but I guess I will. The Foglorious Lodtong! It was- it's a lightning based thing, I don't think you saw it. It did hit, but it was very fucking pathetic-ish. It was pathetic as shit. Also, my light is flickering like it's on crack. What was- what was that? Oh, no, okay. Just get it. Oh. Yeah, no, help yourself. Help yourself, help yourself, fuck shit, fuck shit. Oh, knock him off the edge, it's so easy! Oh! Mm. What the fuck are we doing? Knock 
came off the edge. Fuck that motherfucker. I'm gonna have nightmares. Oh, oh, oh. Sorry. Blast arrow. It's always for my old fighting stuff. I can't even use that. It's pathetic. <laughs> Do you hear her laughing at me? Oh my god! Oh, yeah, Ira's becoming one with the wall. Oh, yeah. Fucking mounter. Yes, mounter. Mounter so. Ah! Hold on. That was very weird. Like, that could have easily been mistaken for a threesome just now. Because Zell was on top of her, I was behind him, Ira was behind me. What are we doing? <laughs> I don't remember Althor ever saying that. What the fuck? Oh, uh, yeah, heal me. Heal me with your thick juice. Oh. <laughs> Put your bright blue ball in my face. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh no. She comes. Mount her. What the fuck? Yeah, mount her. I want you to get on her fucking back. Mount this bitch. There we go, mount her, yeah, mount her, get on her. Fucking bitch. Oh yeah, I get yeah, so mounted. Give me my wrist pistol. Mount her. Mount her. Oh yeah. We have gotten better, because some of those things used to be tough. Like a long time ago, I was like, the fuck is this? The fuck is that? Fucking blue glowing nonsense in my face. Oh. So I feel like coming here has made us tougher. We found some cool items too, like my daggers glow forever. Literally, they never do stop glowing. Hush, she's a suck you, bye, get in. <laughs> suck you in a bye! <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking dying horribly. He just doesn't give a fuck. Ah, oh, me. <laughs> Whoa! I have been released from the bullshit that is happening, huh? Don't stand in the circle, it's insta-death. Oh, I just said not to stand in the circle, it was insta-death. You fucking bastard. Literally, I just said that. Everybody heard me say it. I was like, don't stand in the fucking circle, son. And he's like, let me stand in the circle, master. I'm an asshole! Oh my god! Get the fuck! Get off! Get off him, you bitch! Don't stand in the circle, it's instant death. It's instant death. Mm. That's it, mount that bitch. Mount that bitch! Oh, mount that bitch! Oh, yeah! Oh. Well, I wanted to try to complete one mission before I left. However, I probably ain't gonna be able to do that, and the reason for this is the Echoes from Beyond. So we're going around looking for the slates that glow, and there are two of them beyond that holy white, the Dark Bishop. There's one in the chamber with him, and then there's another one down at the docks a little bit past that. So I, I most likely ain't gonna even be able to complete this mission. There's also another one in the Midnight Helix. Where the Gore Cyclopses, there's another pathway, I forget how to even reach it. It leads to like a little bridge area behind the main chamber where the red water is at. There's a bridge above you and supposedly you can get to it from inside the chamber where the Gore Cyclops actually is. But I haven't really been able to remember how the hell I got there, but I have got there once. And there's one there too. There is like a total of 12 of these things. Or 10, even though the main slate says 12, but there's 10 and I only have 5, so we're missing 5. I know where 3 of them are at least, but I'm trying to re remember where the other 2 actually are. Because, um, if you go to view on map, 
it gets confused. So these are the different floors. So right now, we are on the first floor and the second floor, blah, blah, blah. So you see where that little purple circle is circled there? Where What that's trying to do is it's trying to lead me down to the Falling Sanctuary because there's one there. And I know that, but I can't do it. So, wherever you see this, these purple circles here, it's telling me where to go. And unfortunately, I can't actually even do it. Because I can't get past the the dark bishop that I call the Holy White, because that's what it reminds me of. Um, I can't do it, so... I might not be able to do that. This riftstone will give us fucking free amounts of gold just thrown about on the floor. On my PS3 version, though, I have like over freaking 6 million gold and over 37,000 rift crystals. It's ridiculous. Also, the guardian of the labyrinth isn't here, is he? Don't be a trick. Kill the rats. Kill the rats. I feel like he's coming up the fucking stairs behind me over here. I feel like he's probably down here. There he is. He's like, what are you- Do the light just go off and go back on? Let me come through the wall. I'm an asshole. It makes no sense. I'm going through the wall. Oh my god. He's like, you called me an asshole. How dare you? I will crush you, tiny mortal lady. <sighs> no, please. No. Oh my god. It's death. Death is all that awaits me. Man, I have three rift crisp stones. I don't want to. I mean, uh, not rift stones. Fuck. Wake stones. I have three of them. Right, uh, right here. I don't want to waste a fucking wake stone on this motherfucker. Wiggling intensifies. Ah, ah. I sur- I sur- uh. I survived. How did he kill Althar? He's way the fuck over here. We need to get out of here right now. Uh, why is there a fish? Why is there a fish? Why is there fish? Why is there fish? Yes, bring him to me. That's good. I have a stone that will aid us on getting the ever-living fuck out of here. Let's go. Three, two, one, throw! Yeah! Ah! Oh my god. I don't know how I survived that. I think Zelfin and Era being directly in front of me triggered a hitbox. And it, it got them instead of me. Oh my god. Why are you breaking shit? He's like, let me feel my rage. Let me feel my rage! Oh. You're, you're a funny one, aren't you? I'm gonna take this fucking oil. Take that oil. Yeah, turn that shit. Okay. Well, it's been fun. But I think it's time for us to go now. Quite fucking literally. You. What am I meant to do here, truly? Forgive me. No! The truth remains the. Fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> no, I only wanted to do one of those, thank you. It's your own. Man. The what the fuck? The truth remains that I'm wasting your time. Keep talking to me, it's totally fine. Oh my god. The truth remains, the truth that, remains that you hate everything right now. So, I'm looking for... I don't even know if I have it. <sighs> okay, probably not. Um... No, I'm, I'm looking on the wrong place. So we're looking for explosive rivets. I need that. Oh, I need that. And great ward arrow. It, it'll open up much later, but I need those. Those are my old fighting uh, spells, abilities. Symbol onslaught was one that I had. Very, very, very deep. 
So, symbol onslaught. Was it automatically just, yeah, it was defaulted because I had symbol. So anytime you buy an upgrade to an ability that you already have, it'll automatically set it. So shield strike, if I get the height, the next level up to that, it'll automatically switch on its own. You don't actually have to do it because if you're just upgrading the same move, it'll just switch to the higher leveled one. You don't actually have to switch it. So say I have advanced trigger and there's another one called expert trigger, it'll automatically change on by itself because I already have it set. So that's cool. If there is aught I can do, say it. The truth remains. Pray. Take care. Lady, there's a lot you could do. Like stop being so fucking useless. What am I meant to, to do here? Truth truly. Oh my god. Aught. Damn it. I keep trying to like um what is with that? I'm trying to... Damn it. I remember being able to purify a weapon. If I've done it before. Shut the fuck up. There is a weapon. I'm pretty sure... Maybe I lost it because I died last time. After I had found it. But there is a weapon that I've got here. It has, like, it's a dragon. It has a dragon on the hilt of the blade. Like a little dragon head that comes down from the handle. And then the blades kind of like zigzag a little bit. And I think it's called Dragon's Vein. And you also get those from defeating the main dragon, Grigori. That's why I want to go back and start focusing on the main quest so I can try to get to that point. Because there's two versions to that weapon. You get Dragon's Vein from Grigori that's red. And then here, you're supposedly supposed to be able to find another version of that. But it's like black and, it's like black and gray instead of red. And they're all the two different versions. But supposedly you can get that from purifying um, one of the weapons. But for me, it's just not fucking working. If there is all the truth, the truth remains, that the truth remains to fuck you. I, need your help, I am not going to help you save your fucking master lover. I got things to do, woman. Okay? Sir, I would take you there now if that is what you desire. Fuck yeah, let's go. She's like, so you would abandon me to this vile island. I will never forgive you. See, now she's gone. Because she can only access her at night time. I <laughs> get it. You can only access her at night. I'm going to just not finish that statement. Are you judging the fucking people who live here? I grew up here, you piece of shit. How dare you start judging me like that? What the fuck is wrong with you? You're not God. Anyway. Hey, what's up? Yeah, what up? It's the thought of the bar that sees me through each day of work. You drunk motherfucker. Alright. So now that we're back where we're supposed to be, we're actually gonna go to Grand Soren and try to see if I can, um... What you call it? We gotta go to Grand Thorin because if you remember the main quest, it's been a while since I did it though. We came to Grand Thorin with Mercedes after we killed the Hydra. And you actually have to screw around for a little bit because they you get an audience with the Duke where he's like, I want to meet the Arisen that killed this Hydra. So if you wait around, um, it should be able to... Like, they'll call you, in other words, um, if you're running around long enough in, like, the main town. They'll be like, oh, we've been looking for you, the the duke wishes to meet with you, blah blah blah. <sighs> so I think I had an Eternity Stone. It's supposed to take you back to Grand Soren. I also have a Fairy Stone that I'm gonna just use to get there. I also have a Stone at Bitter Black Isle. Fucking funny. Alright. What meaning do you suppose those stones are worth?
So let's see here. Yeah, thanks for stating the obvious. Hi, Barnaby. I feel like he's going to fucking freak me out. What is this? Dire threats. The Duke's Mant facility. Fuck it, let's just start accepting shit. Kill rabbits. Why the fuck would I kill rabbits? Abbey vicinity. Where is that? Oh, wait. I think I, I think I know. Oh, I know where that is now. The Abbey, I haven't been there yet. It's like this forest place with a church, and that's actually where Kina goes. There's this group called the Faith, and I even have an outfit for it. Basically, um, you gotta go and start killing the undead that's around there. I don't know why Kina would go to a place like that, because she's like, oh, I have to be, uh, go join the Faith to find out how to cure your wound, and that's not even it. So... Her life changed and she basically goes and becomes a nun for no fucking reason. At all. Because her joining the faith ain't gonna cure me. I actually have to fight the dragon and choose what I want to do if I want to become the Seneschal. But I don't want to say that word too much because it might ruin the ending of the game for people that have not seen it. I'm gonna start accepting all this shit. These have way markers, by the way. And you just put it on your map and it'll tell you where it is. There's like these little golden stones that look like the bagels or the badges. And this person placed them all around Grand Soren and a few other places. And you just have to go and pick them up. That's literally it. So I have a wake stone. And I didn't want to waste it here. But I'm going to do this mission to revive this guy's son. Merciful Please. 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 Sir, I know it is not a matter fit to thrust upon a passing stranger, but please, I ask only that you listen a while. Just a short while. Thank you, sir. This child is... is my son. Was my son. His heart stopped not a few hours past. Always weak, his sweet heart. Since he was but a babe, I had long known he would not live long. But to see it... To watch him slip from my grasp, I am left with naught but rage at my impotence. Fain to try any means that I might to bring him back, I look to magic. Even curses, anything to bring him back to me. I know it's for madness, but still I hear. Pray, accept this, the first of those stones. I bought from a merchant, my son and I passed in our travels. He spoke of a powerful magic within him. Gather rocks such as this together, he said, and even the dead shall wake. Not that I am one to blindly believe in such tales, mind. Yet still, I thought there no harm in trying. And so I searched. But by the time I found the second, the whole pursuit ran hard. It is a vain hope to seek immortality in such trinkets I know. I felt a fool So what's funny about this is he gives you those wake shards and he's like, save my son. Oh. However, I already have this wake stone. I have three of my own. So? That stone, you've gathered enough. No, I've already had it. Some fucking master pro six shot collector. Perhaps with those, my son. But I fear I have not the strength to conjure the effect. Then you may leave it to me, for I am a master at casting magics of all sorts. I could end your life right now. Oh. I will heal your son. Watch this fucking shit. And so you will awaken.
Let the life return to you. It is a miracle. It is a miracle. Wow, this is awkward. I feel more familiar with this press now. We made it. Thank goodness. Father. I like how that's all he says. Words cannot express my thanks, sir. I owe you more than I can ever hope to repay. You returned my son to me. It is the maker's work you do, sir. The world is truly blessed to have you. Or is it? That is like the most meaningful thing anyone has ever fucking said to me. Alter. The dead breed wants more. It's a queer sight. <laughs> Look at this fucking face. <laughs> it is a queer sight, yeah. Queer means strange, by the way. A lot of people over the course of years, people have taken such innocent words and have turned them into fuckery. Like, nowadays when you say queer, somebody thinks of a gay guy. But no, the word queer means strange, just like the word gay means happy. People have taken those words and fucked them up. Give me that sweet skeleton key. I'm a motherfucking magic ninja leaper. That guy looked at me like, oh my god. So I think I was taking quests from Maximilian, yeah? If you do enough quests for him, then he'll grant you an audience with the fucking duke. Sorry, I don't know why I did that. Mm -hmm. Let me set as my priority of you. So let's see. Oh, it's outside of here. Great. Fuck. Hello. It will be my honor to show you the okay. choice is yours. The cipher attacks Rata Manstone Foundation. Hear the Duke's directive. Alright. This is a high honor, no is it? See you do, you do not, not take the hero of the details. One what is tidings? The Duke has granted you an audience. His grace will wish to commend you for your valor, blah 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 blah. No. And however, your errand blah 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 blah. Ah, oh, okay, you return to the right of heaven, blah. Sorry. I hope it doesn't turn nighttime by the time I come in here because they'll kick me out. <laughs> Basically, when you go to meet with the Duke, you gotta turn over the. What was that? Oh my god. Um, you have, like, this permission slip that allows you to, uh, take. take part in the search for the dragon, and you have to turn that over. Oh, yeah, you put the crown on my head. Bestie, this guy's a fucking freak. By the way, he's supposed to be the Duke's pawn. They don't tell you that, of course. He just doesn't have his pawn mark because he got rid of it. He turned him into a human. Mercedes doesn't look very happy. I have dual crowns. Everybody's so fucking jealous. Jealous of my dual crowns. She's looking around like, why am I fucking here? I'm dressed like his wife. I wonder what he's gonna say about that. I'm dressed like the fucking Duchess. What? Got something to say? What a piece of shit. Word of your feats has reached us here, sir. You've the worm's own strength to clip the hydra's plate in one blow. No doubt you'll prove more than equal to the dragon. I will wait tell of your next victory. Wow. You seem crazy. I'll grant such gaiety may unite the men and stoke them to greater valor. But do we truly have the time to lend such pursuits with a dragon upon us? Maybe. Longevity can seem a curse when it means living to see such times. Uh. Fuck, I wasn't done talking to people. I got too close. What do you think of my crown? 
Is it not better than your own? Tell me, tell me so. <laughs> I fear your crown outshines my own. Mmm, damn fucking right it does. Look at my fucking sick tassel. It's not a tassel, but... The, the thing at the top. <clears throat> so stop your fucking laughing. He looks like fucking Ganondorf straight up. <laughs> if Ganondorf was human and uh, Wind Waker. <laughs> By my commands, every road in Francis shall be open to you henceforth as a member of the world. May your efforts help deliver us from the shadow of the dark. As long as that damnable beast rolls bread off of it, except anything. She's like, fuck you. Oh. Ooh, come courting. That that trophy sounds wrong. Straight up come courting. Okay. Danger stalks a cavalry than now. Are the rest of you truly blind to the simple truth? Yes. Let us speak another time. Okay. Jillian, you're a bitch. Yes, say my name. Say it. Say it all. This eve's empty pomp is ample proof. All gaiety without a hint of real concern. I laugh. It is well understandable. A people numbed by two generations of peace. Peace cannot expect to know how thick my accent is. Is a lesson taught by fire and sacrifice. Probably let his grace blend before the fire takes on oh, the fucking piece of shit. Shut the fuck up. I'll have to slap the fucking shit out of you. Duke has seemed different of late. What do you mean? The fuck are you talking about? So this is the arisen. I see no difference in your mail and any other knight. What is it you possess that sets you so apart? A hidden strength? Good fortune? I had to fucking take my blood and shove it into your fucking heart, you piece of shit. I'll grant such gaiety. Fuck, fuck. If you get and judges morale that important, I'll attempt to enjoy myself. The fuck are you talking about? What's that is? Arisen. Hail Sam. It seems you truly stand apart from the rest of us. Fucking damn right. Do you see this crown I'm fucking wearing? The sickest shit. Some sneered when I presented the Hydra's head. Said it was your feet alone that won it. In truth? I cannot deny it. I had no hand in it. Just plain fact. But what of the enlistment corps then? What meaning does our fealty hold? No answer to give my men. To give myself. Because you fucking can't, you gotta be kidding me. Festy, you're a jerk. Ah, the glorious return of the inimitable, the indomitable, the unforgettable! Who are you again? Scratch that last one. Who are you again? I had to crush your skull against the wall and watch the blood splatter and glitter in the torchlight, you piece of shit! Therefore, I will go out and talk to the fucking Duke's wife. Is she actually here? She, yeah, so this is the outfit I'm wearing. This is, uh, Lady Eleanor. She's like the Duchess. I'm fucking straight up wearing her outfit. Picking fucking flowers in the dark, are you? My <laughs> Apologies, dear warrior. But to see a face austere as the castle walls adorned with this, <laughs> still, tis more agreeable than the endlessly dour air of most of my husband's song swords. Valor dwells in the heart, after all. I feel like she's coming on me. Not need their raiment to speak for their metal, no. Oh my fucking god. 
Everything she says sounds like she's trying to come on to me. I fear I am remiss in asking your name, sir. <laughs> Arisen? You must forgive me. I fear I am grossly ignorant in matters of war. I had thought all who fought Jeff title warrior. But again, you must excuse me. I am Eleanor, come just a few days past as a bride to the Duke. I pray you will serve my lord husband faithfully, so boy. I presume the crown you bear is a mark of your station as the Arisen? I must apologize for my laughter, good sir. I assure you I meant no disrespect. You would give me your crown, dear warrior? You are far too kind. I shall cherish it. And she takes it. I shall pray for your safe travel, sir. So you can tell if a character is interested in you in this game. Even if you play as a female, you can have... Lesbian all relations. It's fucking ridiculous. But basically, if you talk to a character enough, it happens with her, Celine, Kina, and Sir Maximilian, as far as I know. If you talk to them enough, they get acquainted with you and start to grow an affection for you. So when you talk to them, you'll hear like this ear, ear, fucking chime sound, and sometimes they'll glow with a pink aura. If that starts happening, it means that they are kind of slowly becoming your your character um, character's love interest, rather if you want it or not. That's why sometimes you got to be careful how many times you talk to certain characters, because it'll just force them to become your lover, even if you're not fucking interested in them. Let's see if you can hear it. Until yeah, that. Yeah. Her cheeks red as fuck. I shall pray for your safe travel, sir. You blushing? Until we meet again, dear Arisen. Stop coming on to me. I will slap you. I'm not interested. <sighs> I think I'm more interested in my own pawn. I mean, considering the fact that I was the one who created him. Of course he's fucking attractive. Give me a break. Hmm? By decree of the Duke, you are to be allowed free passage into the castle. Looking like a fucking Twilight Princess soldier. You are advised to conduct yourself fittingly. A grievous breach in conduct will see you removed from the castle, or worse. You will take your orders from the Duke's Chamberlain, Aldous. Yeah, the guy right there. His hand is clipping through his own own self. He has his hand on his hip, and it's just going through it. Fine. Aldous Ludwig Sorm at your service, sir. I serve as a chamberlain in the Duke's court. As you may have seen for yourself, it seems his grace is unwell. In truth, there is worry enough to make any man's head ache. But I fear he ails a horse more than a way, yeah. Perhaps I ought not speak further on the matter, for my own well-being. I am charged with assigning royal laws. Tasks of great importance by the Duke himself. Pray forgive me, Mama, but I ask that you come to see me here in the castle whenever circumstances allow you to take on assignment. The future of this war is murky, sir. May your efforts help to bring its end into sight. Okay, I don't know why I did that. I gotta get out of here. If you stay in here for too long and it turns nighttime, they'll be like, you better leave or we'll fucking arrest you. And they actually throw you in a dungeon. That's why I picked up that skeleton key. In case I get arrested, I can get out. Talk to me. Zell! Zell! No! Zell! Sir Mercedes, acting captain of the enlistment corps, has also come from Brot. Has she? Sir Mercedes, acting captain of the enlistment corps, has also come from Brot. It pains me to burden you, busy as you are with the royal orders, but there is aught I would speak of. It is a cause of worry, though I speak only for myself and not as Jamie. But I beg you, skeletons have been sighted near the capital. These past few days. Elsewhere, I've had no end of reports of secret meetings among the zealots of salvation. Ah, here we go. Now we're gonna go look for fucking Elysian. I cannot help but see that it is intertwined. I have no evidence to prove it. So I'm damned if I allow their kind to go corrupting the good minds of the people for want of evidence. Arisen, I ask this as a favor. Will you look into these events? 
hunt up any thread that connects them. Oh, sure. I I've learned where the cult meets. The catacombs. No I ask you begin your search there. Go and learn what you can. So I thought I had already did this. Rise of the Fallen. Uh -huh. I gotta go talk to Father Joffrey. It's dark as fucking shit. Unless this is another mission. Yeah. So they're meeting under here and the guy's like, Wait, I'll give you a uh, token if you see that. They'll recognize you as as one of our own. Blah, 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 blah. Gotta be careful, because like I said in some of my other videos, some of the cutscenes that involve the Elysian and so forth and so on get copyright claimed by the Capcom channel. Like I said, it, it's not a strike, it's just a claim. So, I don't have to take the videos down, but to eliminate things like that, that are stressful for me, um, I'll just have to cut the video. So, hopefully this video I won't have to cut. Look at that glowing bullshit. Look at it. See, your weapon's gonna glow, mine's glow blue. If you tell me about that alleyway one more time, I'm going to get that lantern you're wearing and set you on fucking fire with it. Watch you burn. Watch you burn. Stefan. Well, yeah. Magic at its heart, at its heart is the transmutation of the user's mind. mind into a physical force. I kept trying to think on where I heard a voice like that before, and I now remember. <laughs> There's a guy in fucking Persona 3 that you talk to, forgot his name, he's like one of the main chairman guys. He talks like that, and he sounds like that, but I don't know if that's him. Its use requires a medium, namely the mage's own flesh. The brain and heart bear the greatest burden. It taxes the body no less than wielding an axe or great sword. Though many seem to view major as a frailer sword. I don't know what you're talking about, but okay. Like how he fucking tells me that and then just runs off like a fucking idiot. It's here, but... Hold on. Shut up, why are you saying that fucking shit out loud? Talk to her. You've spoken to Patrick? Or heard him more like. The way he talks all in verse like that? Some days I take him for a prophet. Some days he scares me. In truth, Patrick frightens me. I'm a simple woman, unschooled in the arts, and yet... In truth... I don't know what she's doing, what she's talking about. Gotta pretend like I know. Get the fuck down there. Wait for the fucking guy to load in. That's why I talked to that lady. We are Star Wars brothers, huh? Oh. I like how his mouth just keeps moving when he oh, stopped talking. Shut up, will you? Just shut up. Oh, God. You, how long were you there? Forever. 
everything. Skeletons. Damn, my I'm not hiding for salvation. It was only a way to earn some coin in the first place. I like how the guy that was talking looks nothing like the guy I'm talking to now in that cutscene. The guy did not have a beard, and this guy does. And the other guy didn't either, so what the fuck? They pay a tidy sum for finding new believers and sending them, them on the, the conclave. conclave though. though I suppose my hand in that yeah, ends today. Let's be, be civil here, friend. We're not enemies, you and I. Surely we can strike a deal that benefits the both of us. Like, say... I'll give me a special bit of merchandise in return, in return for a stack of coin. coin. How about you go suck a dick? Oh, will you help me put this dark business behind me? I want to say fuck you, but I'm a reasonable person. I suppose I could help you. I mean, I am rich in money. Good, good. Try to just tell no one it was I that gave you. Hey. Taggart, I will for have forgotten about you in little to no time at all. It is a key that will allow you into their sanctum. What you do once you're there is your business. Though I doubt you'll manage much. Literally, the other guy that ran away, he's like, let me make the most dumbest fucking noise possible. Yes. Light me. First key to salvation. Oh. Why are you running? Why are you running? Why are you running? <laughs> Why are we running? What the fuck? He just like took one look at me and started fucking sprinting up the stairs like a psycho. What the fuck? Alright, so I think this area, the catacombs, we have to reach it from the outside. I know the red mark is to the gate, but that leads me out to the back passageway. You can't even do anything there, so. Ah! Uh. Shh, we're gonna hear about Celine. Shut the fuck up. That hex has lived there for many a year. Even as a child, I heard cradle tales of old children. His grace is keen to seek out. Even now, he gathers men. Once the preparations are complete. Shut the fuck up, Cell. God, it pisses me to fuck off when I am trying to actual, literally, um, do some. Here, I'm trying to listen to something, and he's like, "Let me talk to you about a bunch of fucking dumb shit." What up? I hear no end of praise for your feats of late, sir. An alliance with a duke now. You've become quite the lordly. Impressive, really. Have your pick. In your life, what will it be today? Oh, yeah. you become quite the lordly. Any fucking way. Trying to decide if I want to get rid of the outfit I'm wearing because it's like the strongest thing I have. Like all of my stats are high. And if I don't keep wearing them, if I switch back to what I had before, all of my stats will drop. So I'm trying to decide what I want to do. Magic Archer's ring. I need to go sell some things. Yeah. Hey. You know more of the witch? Rumors swirl. Most on how she speaks with the dragon. Consoles with her more like some say. Others claim she summoned the worm herself. Whatever the case, we could do worse than seek her counsel if she knows all of the beasts. Speak with the soldiers to hear more of the witch. Even now they mount an expedition to find her. Celine, I know who she is. Hey now, 
warrior such as yourself seeks always finer weapons. If you aid me in a small matter, you shall have access to weapons both fearsome and powerful. What do you say? You're looking for the statue. Excellent. So, have you heard tell of the master weaponsmith in these parts? His talent is without measure, but he's stubborn as a cloudbase and sells only to a chosen circle of clients. To such patrons, he gifts an idol to make his favor known. I must gain such an icon and access to his wares no matter what the cost. It's often said you possess a talent for discovery. Secure me a figurine. And I shall provide weapons the likes of which you have never dreamed. What say you? Will you help? The master works all. You can't go wrong. I'm going to shoot you. Not really. I don't have a gun. No. Everything you have is weak. Why would I waste my time on you, piece of shit? God, I like the way that looks, actually. It lowers my stats like fucking mad sick crazy, but look at the little face on the chest. It's so ridiculous. The fuck is that? I'll go ahead and sell it, though, because I'm never going to wear that. I'm not ever going to wear this thing. Going to just get rid of it. That candle. I don't know why he's carrying that, but okay. Nitty gritty fucking blast arrows. They're for the old fighting style that I used to have. Alright. Sorry. I don't know why I did that. Level up that shield. It's a lot of money to do that just now. Piece of shit. Do, do, do. Why the ever living fuck? The way she keeps breathing. You've made quite the impression to be under direct employ of the Duke. You'll be wanting to fill all manner of new needs now, I. Come by any time, love. Stop that. She's coming on to me real strong. Damn. I must fit. Ooh. I don't want to max them out and make them too heavy, but I want to give them some healing items to... Said he had like a hundred and something already, but whatever. That's about good. I want to give us like, um... A chance here. Because we're going to be going up against a lot of dumb shit. He has 75, I have 87, so... Twenty-five fucking oil flasks. Because I'm a moron. Alright, let's check. He's carrying 90. I have. I can't tell if that's my storage or what he's actually carrying. I think it's.